Okay, up next we're going to do an output measurement test on a green smack cell. The test duration will be 30 seconds. Applied voltage 12 volts DC at 20 amps. We have a known given volume of 0.61 liters. And this is a benchmark for all you replicators out there building smack units. This is what your brand new assembled unit should produce the first time you dump it into your electrolytic bath. So the test begins now. So here we are, we got our smack unit bubbling away happily at 11.4 volts. Fifteen seconds. All you guys that are getting like 0.6 or 0.7 liters per minute, uh, that is not an acceptable output measurement. 30 seconds, 31, 32, 33 seconds. 33 seconds we have evacuated 0.61 liter uh, container and that comes out to approximately 1.1 liters per minute or so. That's the benchmark. Uh, green cells should produce anywhere between 1 and 1.2 liters per minute. Uh, this one's just slightly under my normal 1.2 liter per minute mark as uh, you can see my battery's getting tired we're, only, we're already down to ten and a half volts so that's a pretty good number for having a tired battery um, and as you condition your plates and they approach that optimal efficiency with they get the catalytic uh, layers built upon them you will approach the claimed 1.7 liter per minute benchmark for a fully conditioned cell so there you have it folks 1.2 liters per minute you get anything less than that, you need to look over your design, make sure that you haven't made any mistakes or overlooked anything.